Hi guys, um, today I wanted to show you this Eucalyptus radiata uh, narrow leaf to peppermint. Uh, let me actually make sure I got the species right, otherwise it, it might be pretty embarrassing. <laughs> Alright, I got it. Uh, it's radiata. And um, this kind of bark um, is, I guess, typical for a quote unquote peppermint. And of course, um, I believe the reason why I first got the name peppermint is because of the leaf that smells like peppermints. Um, it is again in the monocalyptus subgenus. Um, as you can see, the leaf veins are relatively sparse um, and they're at pretty acute angles to the midrib and there are a lot of oil glands in the leaf. Um, and there are quite a few species in the peppermint group. There is um, eucalyptus dives, there is elata, there is um, radiata, I, I'm sure there are some others I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, and a lot of the monocalyptus actually have um, juvenile leaves only for a few pairs that are opposite to each other and then quickly transitions into intermediate or adult leaf, but the peppermint group actually retains their their opposite juvenile leaf for quite a long time. Um, so for example, this little sapling here, I believe it's just a self-seeded peppermint from the tree I was showing you earlier. Um, it's up to quite a good size, but you can still see that the, the leaves are opposite to each other. Um, personally, I always feel like this little, this, this sapling has superficial resemblance to Eucalyptus viminalis. Um, sapling, but let's check out the leaf veins. Great, it did not focus. Uh, let me try another one. I don't know why sometimes it just doesn't focus, but other times it just focuses so well. Mm, didn't focus. Well, you might have to just take my word for it. I'm sorry. Uh, the veins are much sparser than the and then the minalis, uh, which is also a dead giveaway. Um, but yeah, again, this is eucalyptus um, radiata narrow leaf peppermint. It it's it's it, it gets to quite a good size, so I wouldn't recommend planting it in your yard backyard if it's small. Um, but it has really high quality essential oils in them and it's a really handsome tree and uh, yeah Eclipse Radiata I'll see you next time